Mark, you remember when we first got started and we didn't have any construction equipment and dad would go to auctions and he bought that old yellow truck. Yeah, I went out to, uh, there was a city Waco auction out at uh, where the old Waco Zoo was at. And uh, we purchased that truck and it had asphalt and painted yellow and uh, we cleaned it up, fixed the seat and it had a six cylinder motor in it. And uh, shortly after that, we bought an aardvark trailer, tongue drawn, that uh, we would load and put the uh, uh, tractor on. Then after that, the little Ford tractor with the box blade. And then after that, uh, we bought uh, that long tractor that had a front end loader on it. Dad would always plow the fields with our tractor that I was trying to keep on the job site, and he wanted to <laughs> use it for a farm tractor. Yeah, but uh, now that uh, that old truck, uh, after sitting there trying to pull those, uh, pull that trailer with that tractor on it, we had to pull that six cylinder out, and put a 351 Windsor motor in it. It was uh, easier to buy a new truck than it was to work on that one. And I remember the, seeing that truck with the springs sticking through the seat and the paint peeling off of the dash and leaning to one side. And Dad said, well, we got something to work on. Uh, you know, money was tight back then. Money was tight back then. We didn't have the option to sit there and buy good used equipment. We had to go buy the roughest stuff out there. Thank God you knew how to use the airless spray rig. Yeah. The airless spray rig, yeah. 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 Turned out looking good. <laughs>